This video will show students how to choose and register for winter session courses. Start by going to Sacred Heart University's website and click here on My Shoe. You'll need to log in, and then once you get to the institution page, you'll see directly to the right-hand side of this picture where it says Student Planning and Advising. Click there. It will ask you to log in to our student planning system, where you will then click here where it says Student Planning. The best way to search for a winter course that you may need is by clicking here where it says View Your Progress. Scroll down through your progress sheet and find any course that says you have not started it. For example, this student has not started the first year seminar. You would simply click here where it says Search under First Year Seminar. Once you're on this course catalog, over here on the left hand side, it looks a lot like online shopping, you're going to click the filter for the winter sessions. Now before we click Winter B, we're just going to remind you that the Registrar's Office has sent out this email showing you when the winter sessions are. Winter A runs from December 14th until January 1st, so it's a short session. Winter B is the long session that begins December 14th and runs all the way to January 22nd. And Winter C is another short term at the end of the winter break. So if you're looking for a longer course, you're looking for Winter B. So we see that this first year seminar is offered in Winter B. So I'll simply select that term. And then I click here where it says View Available Sections. Do not just add the course to your plan. That's saying I want a first year seminar, but not a specific first year seminar. By clicking View Available Sections, you'll see when the course is being offered, who is teaching it, and in what modality. So then you would add section to schedule. Reminder, not add course to plan, but add this particular section of Jeff Kane's first year sem uh, writing seminar to my schedule, and then click Add Section. After you've done that, you'll get a little green check mark that says it's been placed on your schedule, and then you will click the little home. That brings us back to the front page where we click Student Planning, and then we're going to go and register for that class by clicking here. Scroll down through the big blue promissory note. The default calendar is your current calendar, your fall 2020 calendar. So you're going to click this little arrow right here. That will bring us to the winter schedule. There's nothing in winter A, but you see here that I put my course in winter B. So what you'll do at this point is this button for you on your screen will say register for this course. You will click, click this blue button that says accept terms and conditions and register for this course, and it should put you directly into your winter course. Winter courses do not need to be approved by the advisor in order for you to add them, but it is highly recommended that you speak to your advisor before adding a winter course. If you know the name of the winter course that you would like to add, instead of going through the My Progress bar and clicking search, you can simply click right here where it says search for courses. You'll see that that search for courses appears everywhere in student planning. So for example, if I wanted to take uh, an MA131 course, a statistics class, I would simply type it in there and scroll down to see if it's being offered in the winter, which you see here that it is. Winter B, following the same uh, steps, view available sections, and I will see here that there's one online section being taught. If you have any questions about adding winter courses, please speak to your academic advisor or the registrar.